Welcome, everyone, to another episode of Geek Card. I'm your host, Andrew Young, and with me is Mr. Green. What's up? We're going to take you on a tour. On a a three-hour tour? tour? No, it's not three hours. It's under 10 minutes, actually. And it's through the wonderful world of genre films in Toronto by going to some of the greatest genre film locations. Sweet. There's a lot of stuff that's been filmed in Toronto. Exactly. And we're going to go to some of the best locations. This is the patented Andrew Young genre film TL tour. Checking it out right now. This Here it comes. This is going to be good. This is going to be great. I'm excited. All righty. So... This is it, man, the moment you've been waiting for. Yeah. The Andrew Young Genre Film TO Tour. Yeah, this is great. We, we're starting off here. It looks like we're in the middle of Toronto at the at City Hall. This is great. Nathan Phillips Square. Nathan Phillips Square, location yeah. of a big genre film. Oh, yeah? Yeah, man. Resident Evil 2. So this is the first stop. I like how you. I like how you're starting. You're you're, you're, you're easing me into it, and you're gonna work it because there's so many great movies are filmed That's here exactly in Toronto. That's exactly what I'm doing. Yeah. Especially genre stuff. I, I can't wait. Like there's so many great things that have been you here. You love, man. This is just the tip of the iceberg. This is the first stop. You're gonna love where I take you next. Oh really? Incredible Hulk. Yeah. The second stop on the tour. I'm excited. I'm excited. You know, we, we had the first one, and I was like, yeah, no, that, was, that was that was a good like warm up. Resident Evil. What, you know, getting that, going to see Nathan Phillips Square, that's a good warm up. Yeah. I, I'm looking forward to what we're going to do next. We're in a you know pretty historic part of town. You yeah. know, there's Honest Heads right yeah. here. And, Look, you do know, you remember the movie Scott Pilgrim? Love Scott Pilgrim. What was that all about? If we're gonna date, you may have to defeat my seven evil exes. Scott has just had his big showdown with Todd Ingram. Oh, right, And right. he's head buttered right him to hell. Yeah, yeah he's yeah. head buttered him away. Yeah, yeah. And so afterwards, he has a headache. Yeah. So he comes to this pizza pizza, buys himself a Coke Zero, and holds the, the can to his head while he decides what he's going to do next. I guess you could say that that's an integral moment for him. You know, he's making a decision. Totally. I, I guess, but it's like, it's a bit this, it's a, you got to admit, it's a bit of a letdown from Nathan Phillips Square. I don't think so, man. I think this is like, if we're looking at the, the moral standpoint of Scott's character, this yeah. is like an integral scene. This is like, this is like cinematic royalty coming to a place like this. So, like, I thought you were taking me on a tour. I, yeah. I, I, I didn't want to go to a movie. I, I want to go see movie you're, sites. You have to understand, this is another stop on the tour. How is this a stop on a tour? It's a Th theater. Yeah, but this theater has been featured in a big blockbuster movie. Really? Yeah, man. You remember Kick-Ass back in 2010? Yeah, it was a great movie. That's right. We're superheroes. We love us. Yeah, so why are we in front of a movie theater? Because there's a big scene right at the beginning of the film where David and his buddies go see a movie. Okay. I, yes, and it's a great movie. They walk right out of those doors over there, man. Yeah, yes, they do. Oh, yeah. Didn't see that, did you? The last stop on the tour. Oh, yeah, so I, what happened here? Like, I'm looking around. Nothing happens okay, no, here. Okay, no, 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 no. Up the, the street, no, there's Sam no, the Record Man. No, and, okay. it, you know, and they did stuff over there. This building behind us. You mean the empty one? It used to be the world's biggest bookstore. Yeah, 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 I used to buy books here. Yeah, that's right. It was featured in the now classic Short Circuit 2, starring Fisher Stevens and Michael McKean. Seriously? Yeah, Johnny Five. He's still alive, man. Seriously, you brought me Short all the way. Two. You brought me all the way here for that. Yeah. Short Circuit Two. Short Circuit Two. <laughs> if we weren't on TV right now, I'd punch you. This is the dumbest thing you've ever done. I thought you were supposed to take me around and like show me cool things. I showed you the cool things. What cool things? What cool things? You showed me a pizza, pizza, and. At a theater. Yeah. At a defunct bookstore. Places you can easily go to. Costs a lot to go to Casa Loma, man. I don't know. I think this is a great tour. When you're in Toronto, check out these fantastic genre film locations. I actually have an announcement to make. The last location, the world's biggest bookstore, um, was recently torn down, so now it's just an empty lot. But you can still go there and remember that great movie, Short Circuit 2. What? You can find us 
Fridays at 7 p.m. on realityradio101.com, where I will be for sure doing the show in the future. I'm not so sure about this guy. I'm under contract. I'm, I'm here. Yeah, well, I, I've got a contract out on you right now. You can also check us out at geekartshow.com, where I write lots of interesting articles, and this one writes more of this tour nonsense. I don't know, whatever. I don't think I've ever talked about the tour on the site. There's a lot of great articles, videos. It's a great place to be, geekartshow.com. Yeah, when you're not there. You can also check us, of course, out on Twitter. We're at Geekart. And uh, on Facebook, you can find us at Geekart Show. I, once again, for Mr. Green and myself, this is Andrew Young saying, if you're going to geek out, you might as well geek hard.